in the Peruvian Andes, there is a place of sun worship and mysterious ritual, Machu Picchu. To the present, the lost city of the Incas resembles an unbelievable castle. Surrounded by steep ravines on three sides, on the fourth, a protective mountain chain. The warm light of the first rays of sunshine penetrates through the evening mist. And, as with each morning, the mysterious, weather-beaten, ruined city rises again. Like an eagle's nest, its archaic buildings lie between vertical rock walls. Through entrances of sculptured stone blocks appear guardhouses. Walls and embankments seem to defend the inner ruins with its temples and places of cultural interest from unwanted visitors. seamless stone blocks, it seems that even today, 500 years after being built, its flourishing life of yesteryear wants to manifest itself. Only this untamed jungle vegetation could have protected the city from total destruction by the Spanish. Sacrificial altars and ritual stone banks testify to the sun cult of the Inca town. In full view of this tranquil mountainous world, it was here that the so-called sun virgins carried out holy rituals and dances and where human sacrifices were brought to silence the gods. Machu Picchu may have been devoted to a religious cult. It is thought that in the mid-15th century, at the zenith of Inca wealth, about a thousand people lived here. Clad mountain summits look down on the mysterious city discovered in 1911. Planting and harvesting depended on the moon cycle, to which the moon goddess Mamakilia paid homage. The rain god and earth goddess also played an important role in the hierarchy of the gods. In order to survive the harsh climate, the agricultural Incas overcame nature's hostility by building artistically terraced slopes on which to grow their food. In the days of the Incas, the hardy llama was used as a pet and farm animal. To the present, these llamas manage to find hard blades of grass in the scant earth. been possible to discover the secret of the Inca's building techniques. The huge stone blocks fit together seamlessly. Due to the huge quantity of building materials used, 
and amazing construction techniques, it's not surprising that the creation of this city has always been associated with extraterrestrial influences. It's also unclear why, in this part of the world, certain plants thrive, the origin and classification of which no botanist has been able to determine. shaped opening of the three-windowed temple is also a mystery for the archaeologists. In no known culture is this type of window opening to be seen. The temple stands on a massive rock foundation and displays a row of unusual stone masonry. Terrace-styled hills of the city plateaus are linked via stone steps. Complete gardens and palaces are to this day still supplied with water by canals, fountains and mains pipes. Splashing, bubbling water from underground springs runs the small waterfalls into stone basins. up gentle steps helps overcome the height difference between each dwelling and in this way makes good use of hostile terrain. The roots of exotic plants and trees harmoniously appear through the walls and steps of these steep slopes. Mosaic-style boulders prevent them from slippage. To this day, there is no explanation why these architectural city masterpieces were suddenly left deserted by its people. Even now, this holy place can be accessed only by the stony mountainous paths built by its former inhabitants. Should these temple grounds be hidden from the eyes of mere mortals? The mysterious world of Machu Picchu will no doubt remain one of the unsolved mysteries of this planet. This city, which remained undiscovered by the Spanish, was mysteriously abandoned by its inhabitants. Civil war or destruction of its shrine. This remains the secret of Machu Picchu. <laughs>